FBI, have confidential human sources. Um, did the FBI have confidential human sources embedded within the January 6th protesters in, on January 6th of 2021? Well, Congressman, as I'm sure you can appreciate, I have to be very careful about what I can say about when. Even our, now, because that's what you I, told us two years finish? ago. May I finish? Uh, about when we do and do not, and where we have and have not used confidential human sources. Uh, but to the extent that there's a suggestion, for example, that the FBI's confidential human sources or FBI employees in some way instigated or orchestrated January 6th, that's categorically false. Did you have confidential human sources dressed as Trump supporters inside the Capitol on January the 6th prior to the doors being opened? Again, I had to be very careful. It should be a no. Can you not tell the American people, no, Controllers. we did not have confidential human sources dressed as Trump supporters positioned inside the Capitol. Gentlemen, has expired. You should not read anything into my decision uh, not to share information. Director Ray, gentlemen's time has expired. Okay. Take a step back. Get out. Get out. Get out. And Hollywood tear gas in May. <laughs> On display for hundreds of professional photographers conveniently on scene. In this episode, we're going to analyze the climax of the story and show you how a little stage direction and fake blood became an instrumental role in furthering the division of the nation. And he was hiding there. She had no idea that he was even sitting there aiming a gun right at her face. It's not a talk anymore! This is everything wrong with the Capitol shooting. I'm convinced Virginia's American state from what I saw. You guys gonna come in the building? Only on Woos News. <laughs> 